Oh, here's a follow-up on the mini buggy. Go over the dimensions first real quick. Front tires, outer, <coughs> outer tire to outer tire, 49 inches. The rear is 49 and a half inches, outer tire to outer tire. It is 67.5 inches long. Ground to the deck is 44 and a half inches and the decks 38 inches wide I don't have any measurements to the top of the seats but those are full-size bucket seats from Summit Racing this is a shifter it is a 6b manual but it can be shifted without the clutch <clears throat> go-kart style throttle pedal gas tank holds about a gallon Twin cylinder, 21 horse Briggs. This is what <clears throat> originally was on it when it was a lawnmower. Uh, big truck battery. I think it's like 850 amp, crank, cold cranking amp. I took it out of my F-150. I don't drive that truck really, so. Um, the front end. It's pretty much stock. <clears throat> I did make some bushings for... The tie rod in here um, just because take out some of the slop I cut the spindles and re-welded them and plated them um, so they won't break kind of gives it that offset because before they were pitched in the other way the top of the tire was inward and it made the front low and it looked stupid looked like the front wheels were gonna break off but so now it just looks stupid, but stupid the other way. Plus, that takes some of the pressure off the clip that holds it on. Probably eventually upgrade that to uh, like a C-clip uh, retaining ring or something. But anyway, let's move on. Um, so stock rear and stock pulleys. The pulleys have not been changed. I haven't checked the speed on it, but I'm guessing it's probably around 12, maybe even 15. <clears throat> Still has the governor on the engine. The governor has not been modified, so it's probably running maybe around three grand. It's probably not even running full governor speed. But key switch is up here. Um, choke is over here. Of course, steering. It's just been lengthened, and it can all be unbolted. And the deck is just held down with uh, self-tapping screws, so it could easily be removed or whatever um as of this video i've got a new deck or a drive belt that i haven't put on yet because this one starting to fray it's it was like that when i started this build it's not from driving around it was already like that so i've got a new belt and slap on it shouldn't take more than 10 minutes but the way my day's been going i'm gonna do it some other time but anyway uh, this is the clutch. I uh, just press down. About as simple as it gets. Uh, like I said, you can shift it without the clutch. Um, 36 inch super swampers on the rear. <clears throat> I think they're 36 by 12. Yeah, 36, 12, 50 by 15. They're on 15 by 10 rims six log but that doesn't matter they're just welded to the lawnmower rim in the fronts i think are like a one 175 or something 185 65 15 junkyard specials but um uh, give her a quick start up here always make sure it's in neutral because there's no neutral safety switch so it will take off two people on it it doesn't steer too bad i mean once you're rolling it steers pretty easy i mean 
It's just a buggy. It's just meant to put around. It's not fast. It's plenty low gear. I mean, it climbs the hill up in front of the yard, no problem.